guys, I'm sorry for the face to camera video. Uh, I'm basically, I don't want to do face to camera hauls too often, but um, I do enjoy it. However, I'm on my phone, so everything is it's kind of mirrored, I guess. So, future, don't try this is my left, this is my right. So, so the back, the right is going to be the wrong way round, and um, I might be able to de mirror it. I'm going to try. Um, I've never actually tried it before, so. Um, apologies so yeah i went shopping um this is going to come after the saturday vlog so hello um i went shopping i went to home bargain someone gave me kindly gave me some money um they gave me quite a bit not quite a bit but um a good a chunk they gave me 50 pound to buy stuff for me and my flat and they were like just spend it and what you want for yourself what you want for the flat even treats you can even get yourself some chocolate and stuff like that so so we're going to eat, so I'm really grateful for that. Um, so before I start off, I went to Subway. So it's my Subway. I got my usual turkey and ham with a cookie and a refresh. I was going to get, going to get some ash browns, but they didn't have any in stock. So I got um, cheese garlic bread, which I've already eaten because I haven't had anything to eat today. And it's like 4pm, I think. Um, and this, the, the, hash, the cheesy garlic bread was for free. Um, mainly because basically I went, I walked into Subway and they were like, sorry, we're going to do a, a, um, we're going to do a sanitise of the place before we let anyone else in. And they like, it's all right if you wait. And I'm like, yeah, sure. Should I wait outside? And I'm like, wait wherever you want. Uh, we shouldn't be that long. So I just sat down on one of the benches in town. If you know Fleetwood, there's a bunch of benches. So I sat down on one of those and I was chilled and um, texted Michael, had a relax. My head is pounding because of the social anxiety, being out in public. Oh, Barkins with a stress um, and just general lack of fluids intake for today. So, yeah, I'm, I've learned my lesson and I'm trying to make it go away. So, um, and I got, and he said, as a thank you for waiting, I just got some for free. Um, the other guy got, the guy who came in after me, but he was actually waiting outside the door. I waited on one of the benches. Um, he got, I think he got like a free cookie or something like that. So he got something for free. Um, they don't usually do that. It is a one-off. So if you, in case if you're in a situation like this and you're like, sorry, we've got to, they'll probably like either give you a discount. I think he got a 10% discount actually. Um, instead, um, you'll get a discount or something like that. I don't know if it's normal, but in this one it was. And today was hectic. Like, I think they <laughs> Well, I went to Home Bargains and went to Subway and there was different issues than that one. So obviously Subway needs to be clean. So I was like, I was all right waiting because I, I could chill, just relax and stuff like that. And Home Bargains, Home Bargains, right, if you're in Fleetwood, you know, it's a big Home Bargains. So it has own, its own car park. And I'm guessing they were controlling the numbers um, because the one in St. Anne's, they don't really do that anymore. And uh, last time I went was uh, like a month ago. Maybe they do it again. Um, so you had to queue right around the corner, wrapped right round the car park and everything. So you had to walk out the car park, round the back to get to the queue. So that was funny. Um, and then I went in. It was, it was quite busy. Um, I didn't. I did feel comfortable because it was my first time since the whole thingies happened that I've been in the Fleetwood Humbuggers without a mask on. No problems whatsoever. I also went on the trial without a mask on. I didn't have a mask. Um, they didn't show up and I just asked the guy, I'm like, I've got asthma, is that okay if I don't wear a mask? And he's, he's like, it's fine. Um, so we, should, we don't usually check if people like ask why or why not they're wearing a mask. So if I want to go and pull the chest again, I could just say, well, I'm going to try them anyway. On a bus, the bus drivers are scary. But yeah, so that's nice. Um, sometimes I can wear one, so I do try to wear it as much as I can. However, when I'm walking around in a shop... Um, I do get quite exhausted, so I'm not able to breathe properly, so I'm in a mask, kind of like, <laughs> makes it worse. Um, trying to dry myself, so don't come after me, people. Um, I'm trying to dry myself. Uh, so yeah, uh, we had a palaver. I went to pay in my, my normal till. It's every single home market, I always go to the biggest one, like for the trams, because I'm obviously a big girl. I put everything on, and, and they were having problems with cards, so I was waiting, waiting for the till for around 15 minutes. 15 20 minutes and they were just having problems with card readers and everything apparently it's all over the country so or nationwide i don't know the difference so um, and she was like sorry this one this card machine will not work at all anymore and i was like okay so i'll, I'll put everything put everything on 
the conveyor belt back into the trolley, went around and I got served by this lovely lady and she was like, relax, take your time, because I always rush when I'm packing, but she was like, relax, take your time, have a natter, and I was like, how about we offer a car machine a cup of tea, <laughs> so yeah, anyway, she was lovely, so we had a natter and stuff like that, so it was nice, so um, I'm going to show you what I got, I got some things, some flat, I got other things, I got things, I got things everywhere, um, I went in this shop, with, an, with, no, with no limit, um, this this will be happening every month. Um, maybe if I save up and I need some sort of thing, maybe yes, maybe no, we don't know. Um, but this is um, what? Um, this is a at the moment I'm going to treat this as a one-off situation. So yeah, because I'll usually do my weekly shops at Aldi, even though I'm trying to make them less so I can save more money, but we'll see. Um, so this, I got my trolley, which is jam-packed, backpack, and this, I'm just going to pull it out of this bag, uh, backpack and trolley, yeah, then we're going to go, 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 go. So some things I did go, I did not write on the list, but I do, I did know what I did need, I did need. So there was a couple of things there that I needed, and I'm like, right, you got to decide, because you won't be able to carry this home. So I had, I needed a laundry, you know, um, not a laundry, what are they called? Um, when you dry your dishes, one of those, or a dish organiser, I could only carry one, because this bag is quite big. So I got the drying thing, just because it's more important than an organiser, because I don't have a lot of cutlery. And I could just leave it in here and take it out whenever I need it. And next time I will get a cutlery organiser, and then the time after that I will probably start getting more cutlery. Um, if this is just, I don't know. I have my... Um, See if I got the receipt somewhere. Um, this was um, I tried to I tried to go as cheap as I can. However, sometimes it was um, I'll just drain it. Uh, one. It was two or one sixty nine. Like I'm trying to show like half of the numbers have come off. So it was I think it was one sixty nine. I think so. Yeah, this is just it's just a regular strainer. So you put the knives, fork, spoons. Um, cups and plates so that's going to go in my sink next i got sponges i have been using wet wipes i'm all right with using wet wipes but if i've run out of sponges um i'll probably swap and change uh loo roll just because people are buying buy in again and uh, to be honest i don't want to be caught in a situation when i i do have to go to shop and there's nothing there so every time i go shopping i get a packet of loo roll um usually it's anytime i go shopping a packet of loo roll um painkillers and some sugar for my tea that's all i go out for that's all i get every single time um obviously sometimes i'll add on like laundry detergent and stuff like that but i usually try and get them um, at least once and i only get a four pack just because um i just don't want to get overwhelmed with a 24 pack and i'm like i don't drive so how am i supposed to bring it back um tuesday i did no yesterday i did rely on my dad picking me up just because i couldn't i had to ask him because i got this um clothes hang clothes error but i couldn't bring it back so i was asking my dad hey i want to get this however i can't carry it back so i'm glad he did because i would have been late um then i got parking i haven't had parking since last year because my dad usually gets it from the bakery but um i got it this is from home bargains it was 99 cents two loaves and it doesn't expire because i usually have like an afternoon snack so it's usually like a cake and some bit of savoury, some crackers, but I didn't get crackers. Um, I got so bad day. Uh, 3rd December 2020, so obviously that's going to be gone before then. Um, now, backpack, I got one of these. These are Snacks' um, breakfast muffin. It is literally a sausage and an egg. No, it's like, a, no, it's sausage and egg muffin, but just without the egg from McDonald's, so I really like them. Um, th there's these ones, and there's the other ones, like, you know, the proper good ones. Um, are they rustlers? No, I think they are. I don't know, but they're quite expensive. This was like really, really cheap, like nice my pants. So it's a one-off. So I'm gonna have it tomorrow morning for breakfast. Um, I got chicken noodles. Um, I was gonna get a single packet, but um, they only had the beef flavour, and obviously I don't eat beef. So I got a packet of four of these for nice little pants. Um, obviously I'm gonna put other stuff with it. I got two of these. I haven't had these since. Third year of university, I used to have these with my meatballs, that's my like vomit, you know, the, the smarter ones, 
anyway they're mashing apart so these were 49 pence each i believe um i really really like them i prefer like the original it was the cream flavored one but literally you just boil the kettle put it in and it's like instant mash so I used to just eat one and it's over tea and I'm just like, you've got to mix things up. So next I got some box of Viennies. I love these. Viennes, Viennese. I never can pronounce the name right. Um, I tried to get the cheapest, but these were quite cheap. So, um, yeah. I got Panadol, like I said, every time I'm trying to get um, a good stock of things. I'm not going to go overboard. Uh, I do. Um, I don't go out to get like the old brand uh, painkillers. Like, you know, like the cheap ones because they don't work as well, they don't work for me. So these, these ones, I don't know why, but they just do. I think it's because they just do it more quicker. I, I don't know. However, I do, I swear by Panadol. I also got some Hey For Your Analogy Relief. They have two tablets. Um, If you do take Hey For Tablets from the doctors, please check which ones you take. Because I take Cetrazine. So as you can see, um, I have the actual, like, your prescription version. But just in case, like, I miss out on a summit or i don't have enough allergy tablets i do have a backup of these um i can't afford to go out and buy them but just because sometimes it can be quite expensive so that's why i do have them on prescription for my asthma um next i got two of these but the other one's gone and the makeup remover wipes because like i said i wear makeup now and i think some of my wipes are drying up but i just got some the two for a pound um i got some marshmallows for the hot chocolate that i got yesterday i think it was but yeah, marshmallows. Um, and then I got chopped pork with ham. It's literally like spam, but you just, you know, I'm probably going to put this with mac and cheese or noodles and, or like this or like these or, you know. Um, next, I got some really fun stuff. I will, um, because as you know, I've got a bath. So this isn't all of them, I think. Um, I did get some other things, or maybe I just got two, I don't know. Um, but as I have a bath, um, now they have a good selection of bath things. So they have bubble bath and then they have bath bombs. And lots of Christmas ones. I was going to get the box, I had different ones, but I looked at it and I, I don't like the look of them. And I like these single package ones. So I got some, I'm pretty sure I got more than two, but I don't know. But first, I got a snowman, snowman one, so I'm shaking, I know. So there's that one. And then I've got this one, I'll probably have to like split it in half or something but it's like a gingerbread so yeah these are home bargains they have loads of bath bombs and i'm like i really want to get bath bombs this year because i actually have a bath it's like amazing okay so next is everything in here i put so much stuff in here it's ridiculous so next i got tea towels because i do not own any tea towels i've been here for a month well a month tomorrow and i don't have any tea towels so i got a single I think it's a single one yeah just one i couldn't decide the prices were all over the place i'm just like just get one uh i got a lighter for matching matches candles um i didn't know they sell them at home bargains because um, the one in liverpool always had like the, all the flicky ones that people used to light cigarettes with i wanted the candle one so mm -hmm. well it's candle and barbecue so i'm really happy with that um magic stars i can always get magic stars when i go to home bargains i don't know why uh, shortbread biscuits, these are for treats. Um, actually, these are just going to go with the afternoon tea, so I have sweet stuff. And, so, afternoon tea, afternoon snack, same thing. I just make a cup of tea whenever mine's empty. So, yeah, I'm thirsty. Yeah, so that's that. Um, I have two of these, there should be more. Uh, really big numbers. Um, because like one of them has numbers on, the other two don't. So I just got these. Um, thankfully they wrote just one of each because in Liverpool my house number was 101. So yeah. Uh, clothes pegs because we have clothes line outside that's communal. However, I only have two pegs that I used to peg up some open food that I needed to bring here. So I got some clothes pegs, these are 99 pence. Um, I got these tuck biscuits. Uh, Michael likes these. He likes a cheese sandwich flavour though. I am going to be sending him some for Christmas, I think. Because with all the palaver and me going into a refuge, I haven't, I wasn't able to send him his birthday present. So I'm doing... I'm getting him a Christmas present and I might put some birthday stuff in there. And then next, for his birthday next year, I might put the rest of the birthday stuff. And obviously the new birthday stuff. Um, I got some stickers. Um, I used to get them all the time. Oh, here's another one. Um, I don't know where the other sticker's gone there. 
I do. I got two packs of stickers, so I got the Flamers and Flamingos. I love these stickers. I got the Hippie Vans, but I don't know where they are. Um, I got a Novelty hand soap. It's Christmas. Um, I'm doing a thing. Uh, once a year, I will get one decoration per season. So, um, I this year I put this year's Halloween decoration. So I've only got one. Um, and then I'm gonna get one Christmas decoration at Christmas. And it's so I don't buy too much. And yeah, so. Yeah, anyway, I got this hand soap for the bathroom when my other one runs out. And, or as soon as it hits December, I'm gonna put that in. And like I said, I can't build up collections so far just because of like issues with money and like stuff like that. I don't have a lot of money, and I was able to get most of this stuff. Um, the person approves of the stuff I bought, um, but I wasn't able to get as much as I can because, like I said, limited with money. So I'm trying to do bit by bit. I got this one. This is a shooting star bath bomb. I don't know if you could put it all at once, but yeah. I'm trying to have, I love baths, but I should only be having them once a week because of like the cost of water and stuff like that. And um, I also got one of these. This is a cherry Madeira cake. This is one of the last things I got. I looked at it and I'm like, cherries. Um, I loved, I love glazed cherries. I don't like them when they're not glazed, but when they're glazed, I love them. And um, this expires. Eighteenth of November, so that's fine. Uh, here's the other stickers, these are the hippie vans, um, I got hot dogs, um, no hot dog buns though, but I got hot dogs, I <laughs> don't um, I got these, I love these, these are Christmas puddings, they are chocolate with, um, do you know the, uh, the sweets that pop in your mouth? Yeah, it's these, um, that's what they've got in it. Uh, Halloween decoration, um, uh, It's so cool! I love it! Like I said, I was only going to get one decoration a year, so this is my Halloween decoration for this year. Um, I have no Halloween decorations whatsoever. I got a dehumidifier just because bathroom, I want to be careful, so I just got one of these. Um, I got Umbrella Pingles for crisps. Um, I think the rest is... The rest is other types of goodies, so it's gonna be exciting. Uh, Princess chicken and white sauce, I love this. Um, I don't get it too often just because it is one pound over one, one pound something, but yeah. I got razors, these are I prefer these other ones, but um, they don't sell them and they're too expensive. So these are Wilkerson Sword Extreme Extreme Three. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure the male razors are better, but <laughs> I just can't be bothered buying them. Uh, chocolate coins given i always get them um rest of the wipes and then the rest of this is let me see how much three more minutes is heavy stuff so that there's good stuff in there first i got a monster punch i love this it is one pound nine i know but um i really like it very lightly i can't put it in the fridge just because it might explode so it's gonna go in the cupboard uh, next I got bubble bath. This is aromatherapy, the sleep one. I like this one because um, I have a bubble bath, but I just want to make sure like I got a bit more, so I'm happy with that. Um, and then next I got I watched a YouTube channel. They don't upload anymore, but they uh, they bought a load of Crusher, and so I bought myself some. It's basically like um, cordial for your milk, so. You put, um, it just gives you the measurements there, and it's literally you just add it to your milk and it makes strawberry milkshake. Problem is, anything strawberry flavored makes me bounce off the walls, so it gets me hyperactive. I don't know why, it's just a thing. Um, I got some Vimto, they didn't have the normal Vimto, so I got the remix watermelon, strawberry, and peach. I absolutely love this flavor because I love watermelon, and then last is the goodies. So if you didn't know, I got a candle the other day and I got some candle lighters. So I went on Home Bargains the website last night and I decided which ones I like. So I've got one, two, three, four. So the first one is candy cane. Um, oh, very minty. <laughs> um, the next one I got is one mouthful of cinnamon. This is a given. This is a go-to scent for me at Christmas time. Um, I've had it in halls, I've had it in the house, I love it. Um, next is gingerbread. 
the, the one that makes me hungry. Very strong gingerbread. And lastly, is this is a Halloween one. It is trick or treat. And it's, it smells like sweets and orange. I don't know how to explain it. I like it though. It smells like sweets, orange, pumpkin. I don't like pumpkin now. But yeah, it's quite nice actually. Um, and that is everything. Anyway, I'm going to go now. I'm hungry. And I hope you enjoyed. And I shall see you later. Bye.